Hi, and welcome to my bag tutorial. With your short scope system, you received 20 unique tags. These tags are used to collect your shot data. For the system to recognize which club hit each shot, we need to know what tag has been screwed into each club. So we ask that you create clubs in my bag page that match your physical clubs and assign them to the tags that you intend to screw into your clubs. Let's take you through the process. To create a club, click Add Clubs button. Once the Add Clubs button has been pressed, a pop-up titled Add Club will appear. Firstly, select the type of club you wish to create. Is it a driver, wood, hybrid, iron, wedge or putter? Next, we must select what particular club it is we wish to create. Thirdly, we must assign the club to an equipment make. Finally, select the model of the club. To cancel the creation of the club at any point, click the X icon at the top right of the pop-up. To complete the creation of a new club, click Submit button after all fields are filled in. When a new club has been created, it will appear under the club section of the page. To assign a club to a tag, drag the club card to a vacant tag slot. You can assign any club to any tag that you wish, with one exception. A putter club must be assigned to the P tag. This is because the P tag uses a different algorithm to collect data than the other tags. If you play any golf with a club that has a tag in it but have not manually assigned a club to it, we will automatically create a club for you. The club will be created based on what tag was used. If it was a 7-iron that was used, a 7-iron club will be created and assigned a default make and model. The type of club and the make and model can both be changed later through editing the club. If you wish to edit a club, click on the club card. It should be highlighted red if successfully selected, then press the edit button. Make the necessary changes to each section of the club details, then hit submit when happy. Editing should only be used for assigning a make and model to an automatically generated club or fixing a mistake in a manually created club. If you wish to add a new club, use the add club feature rather than editing an existing one. Having separate data for all clubs is great because it allows you to compare and analyse your clubs, meaning you can put the clubs that perform best in your bag. Now that you can create several of the same type of clubs, we have introduced a new colour feature to help you differentiate one from the other. If you create a new club that is the same as an existing club, it will be shown as a different colour throughout your account. Here you can see my new driver has been highlighted red. To directly swap two clubs in a tag slot, you must firstly move the assigned club back to the inactive club section. A club can also be deleted, but only if it has no data attached to it. A club will have data on it if you assign a club to a tag and you have used that tag in a round with your shot scope. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any further questions, please contact us through our support website.